Well, well, well. That was a very good direct. I'm not going to lie. Oh, man. I'm just going to... I'm not going to say anything about what happened other than, like, the fighters. Because I am going to show the fighters that are going to be in the... That, was, that were in the direct. But that's it. I'm not going to say anything else about it. I want you guys to discover that for yourself. So, yeah. Please do that. Because that would be cool. And share your thoughts in the comments and stuff. So, yeah. Um, anyway guys, hello everyone, I'm the Moose 76 here, back with some more Super Smash Bros. Ultimate Customs, and there was a Direct today, and I'm so happy, because that was very amazing, like wow, that was beautiful, oh man, um, <laughs> that was such a good Direct, anyway, um, I'm sorry I'm doing two videos in a row, I just really wanted to get these fighters as fast as possible out, also I kind of finished them kind of quickly, so I kind of wanted to like, do them fast, I wanted to, um, like make a video on them. So yeah, um anyway, let's get started. First fighter we have is um fighter number 60 Echo Ken. Now, I did make this um um when um the leak was out or something like that. I didn't make the I made it actually with um this colored gloves, this colored hands, not with like brown hands. Um because I thought it wasn't, I didn't know it was going to be like that, and I actually did not color the hair yet, so that was actually good, because the hair wasn't the color I was going to do. It was like a more of a blondish color that I was going to do, not, um, like, this is kind of like darkish, like yellow kind of. Like, I kind of like made the design and stuff anyway, so whatever. And the eyes also. The eyes were actually, uh, just regular, like, black pupils and stuff, with like, I mean, black eyes with white pupils and stuff, but I added some light blue in there. Um, so what I did over here, um, I actually got red legs, and I got some, uh, and then I painted, um, the peach on the bottom, and then, um, this is what I did, um, so I got, oops, this is kind of sticky to the legs, it doesn't break, I don't want it to break, or rip, I mean, oh no, okay, okay, um, I actually got, it's actually kind of funny because I got Ninjago Kai, uh, his legs and stuff, which is actually kind of funny because it has the, uh, the belt around it too, so I actually just got the same thing for Ryu and stuff, and I put it over there like that. And then I got a red torso, and then um, I got uh, arms, and painted it peach with brown hands, and then I made the little brown parts of the uh, gloves and stuff in the back and stuff, little rips in the in the sides of the arms, and then the 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 chest and stuff with the robe like opening and stuff. And then I already showed the head and the hair was sculpted by me. And yeah, um, I actually kind of want to compare him to Ryu, if I can find him. Um, where do I put Ryu? I have a lot of characters here. I need to fix them up. I, I'm going to be honest, I did fix them up once. But, um, oh, here's Ryu. Um, I, I had to, like, like I made a mess of it because I was actually working on something with them. So yeah, I'm not going to say what I was working on. But anyway, um, here's Ryu compared to Ken. Um, so yeah, I think it looks alright. I didn't make any updates for Ryu, at least not yet. And I think they look pretty cool, but side by side, so yeah. Also, here's the Hadouken thing or whatever. Um, anyway. Um, next fighter is mm, fighter number 69. Heh. Okay, <laughs> I'm sorry. Um, is Incineroar. He came out really good. I really like the way I made the face and the head, I mean. Um, I think he came out really good. Um, I actually used, okay. I actually um, used Woody arms or like Toy Story arms for this and red hands. I actually uh, actually had apparently I did have some red hands lying around. I actually thought I was gonna. I'm saying actually a lot. I thought I was gonna use a uh, dark red um, hands because I had like one of those, but I could replace those with that. I guess I don't know, but I'm not doing that because this is like a bright red color, and I was like, yes, this is perfect. So yeah, um, I actually got uh, black uh, legs because I don't have red legs. Um, I, I can't find any. I probably do have some, but I don't know. And um, I made like the torso and stuff. I mean, no, I'm, that's not. I shouldn't go to the torso right away. Um, I made the waist and stuff. I made the belt or whatever it's called, the fiery thing. And um, it doesn't look like the best, but it's okay. And the tail and the back looks cool. Um, I, I sculpted it and stuff, I made it with tin foil. I don't really want to take it off because it will be annoying to put back and I want it to rip and stuff. Here's the back. I know it kind of looks like light, I know it looks brighter, the chest 
part or whatever, the back part on this side than that side. Um, I don't know. I, I, I kind of, I tried to do the front side color for, again, but it didn't really work, so I was like, whatever. Anyway, it's not like you're going to be looking at the back side like the whole time anyway, so whatever. So again, I did woody arms, then I made the design, then red hands and stuff, and um, the head was sculpted. I think it came out really good. You can kind of see the eyes. Um, it was kind of hard to like put in there, but I tried my best. It's okay. Um, and then pink nose and stuff, and um, here is the back of the thing. I actually like this is like, I, this came out like much better than I thought it would be. Honestly, it looked really good in my opinion. Yeah. Oops. Oh, it actually works as a stand. Um, last but not least, but wait, guys, there's more. I promise. So what I did over here for the number fighter number seventy, the DLC fighter. The Piranha Plant. Not only, none other than the Piranha Plant. Um, yes, this is fighter number 70. This is the DLC character. <laughs> yes, there will be DLC. Oh yeah, that's also another thing I'm gonna say. Now, I didn't glue this to this. I actually, um, this is separate, but I just somehow like manages to stick on there. Somehow, like I'm not even like putting it on there. I'm just like, well, I'm not, it's not like connected by anything. I'm just putting it on there. So I sculpted this whole piece and I do not want to like touch it because like I just finished painting it and like I um, did that and I just made tin foil and stuff and then I made it like with clay and stuff and it looks all right. Those are basically all. Those are the those are the fires that were revealed today, guys. And there's more to come. So please, actually a few more to come. And then after that, the DLC as I just told you guys. So whatever. Um, there's yeah. I'm gonna make those last few fighters that I have left. I'm, I'm gonna show those last few fighters that I have left and the DLC characters that I have, and then I'm gonna like make a thing and stuff. So yeah. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed uh, this video and the direct. If you guys watched it, and please let me know in the comments how, what you guys thought of it. And I really like to know. I really would like to talk to you guys about it if you guys would want to do that because I love talking to you, to people about uh, Nintendo and stuff. So yeah. Anyway, guys. Have a fantastic day, and I'll see you guys next time. Thank you so much for watching. Comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye, guys.